<laughs> Robin. Let's see what that station's doing. Turn down our music. Yeah. Back to the wave in uh, Charleston, South Carolina. The most music. The best music. Any station that has, like, the most music, pretty much saying that their air staff stinks. They want the least amount of air staff talking. And they're, they're so out of touch by even saying that, because nowadays you could get almost every song possible on your yeah. iPod. So yep. to say you have more music than anyone else is just completely ridiculous. The best of the 70s, 80s, 90s, and zeros. <laughs> <laughs> the thousands. Hey, Bob, what's up? There he is. Bob yeah, Kelly, everyone, in studio. It's been a while. Bob, man. Happy, Merry Christmas. I haven't, seen, I, haven't yeah, I haven't seen you in a while. Happy Hanukkah. What's happening? Why would you say Merry Christmas and Happy Hanukkah? That's like a month you. ago. <laughs> I haven't seen you in three months. Well, Happy St. Paddy's Day to you then. I it's quit been a while. smoking since the last time I seen you. You did? How long now? Three months. Three months? Yeah. And? Pretty good. Uh, great. I feel fantastic. I can sleep through the night with that. Waking, I was waking up four or five times a night, coughing so bad that I'd pass out almost. My head would go numb, <laughs> and just something would come out of me. I don't even know what it was like. It's a good time just to quit. Phlegm and some something I ate would just flop out and go whoop, into the toilet. It was just that and you bad. Were hacking that bad, and that's what made you made you quit, huh? Yeah, I almost pa I would pass out. I would, I would get I would cough so hard that my lips would go numb. You know when you did that when a kid when you'd breathe and then someone would choke you. No, <laughs> never. <laughs> you never you be, did that? And you'd be going, Dad, cut it out. <laughs> <laughs> you, never did, you never did that? You woke up and your hiney was sore? No. <laughs> no, uh, no, I don't know. that. Never breathed heavy and been choked out. Wait a minute, dude. You, you never... <laughs> I've heard of the pass out game, your, yeah. Your lips and you... There was like a game that kids would talk about, but I've ne I never saw it played. I, I Somebody must have done it. And it was you would hyperventilate. And then uh, another kid would get behind you and grab you by the chest and, like, lift you up while squeezing your chest and you'd, you'd pass out. Right, yeah. It's like a game. But you'd literally wake up and your, you, your whole body would be numb. And your, your tongue would be hanging out of your mouth it's like, like a, a cheap buzz. And your lips would be just tingling and all drool would be just whipping yeah, out. Yeah, it's called no blood going to your head. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. But, yeah, it was, I mean, if you had nothing to do and you were poor... Uh, that's, that's what you did for fun. Uh, couldn't afford video games. Couldn't buy a <laughs> pong. You choked each other out. <laughs> choked each I didn't other have, out. Uh, GI Joe or game. pong, so I have to choke uh, each other out. I remember the, the <laughs> game. The game in my school was they would just grab you on either side of your neck, nobody realizing you're just grabbing somebody and just squeezing both jugulars. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the person would just just <laughs> cut off and circulation. Just keel the brain. Over. It's better than going under a porch with your best buddy. Well, that guy's not here right. today. Jimmy would do that. <laughs> yeah. yes. There was a kid in my elementary school that used to go around and karate chop people right in the throat. <laughs> and he nailed me once at the locker. He would just do it, and he was known to do this. And if you were unsuspecting, like if you saw him coming, chin you'd, down. you'd chin down, you'd cover your throat up and go, no, and I'd run away or just get away from me. But he would come up and just go, fuck. And you, you'd <laughs> just start choking in the hallway as everyone laughed. Was he Asian? Nah, he was some, like, Italian kid who was into karate and shit, but he was one of those kids that learned karate, but not the lesson that's supposed to go along with it of discipline and yeah, he's not only doing use it for a fight. Yeah. Like, he yeah. learned it, he's learned it, and wanted to use it on a daily basis. <laughs> right. Right. Yes. Like, I'm, I'm fucking... Someone gives him the wrong change. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Walk right, right on the throat. Throat. shit. Yeah. Right. He's going to the Cobra Kai right. school of karate. Definitely the Cobra Kai. <laughs> will you finish him? Yeah, will you go with the prom with me? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Fucking trail of bitches laying on the floor. <laughs> Time to go to bed. That was a real scumbag. Uh, but uh, yeah, choking out. Yeah. But, but uh, like you're saying, you cough like that, and that's what's happening. You, you're losing blood pressure to your head. The sickest part is, though, is I did this for two years. I I, I smoked. Yeah, you know, I'm smoking, and I actually learned to make that just part of my life. Like yeah. this is what I do. I hack until I pass oh, out. And I stayed at Dane's house in. Uh, in California, and all you hear me all night is just heaving up stuff, and I'm well, running to the wonderful. bathroom, and I would puke up phlegm. Just these. Thank just, God you were probably in a wing of his house that was away from his wing. <laughs> yeah, does does so, he have uh, a big house now? 
He has the same apartment, but I mean, he's just apartment. A, yeah, he, he's just retarded. He just sold out the garden in Boston. Seventeen thousand people. Of course, seventeen thousand people in two days. He sold out. He's doing his HBO hour special. Let's see them canceling his fucking MySpace account. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, he's he's actually, dude, he's helped me out. These, oh, Tom, I hope, oh. Dude, we talked about it on the show, so yeah, get into dude, it. Dude, you lost your MySpace account. This, who loses their MySpace account? I'll tell you who. Somebody has the same name as uh, a black rapper, singer, R. Kelly. This is what happened. I had Dane, because Dane pretty much has the same amount of friends as Tom. The uh, founder of MySpace. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, he called up, you know, had some connections, and uh, this is what they think happened. Uh -huh. That it was a mistake. My account deletion was a mistake. That somebody from R. Kelly's camp, the singer. Right. The singer. <laughs> the singer. Ratted me out. Or said, you know, this guy's pretending to be R. Kelly. Okay, and somebody from MySpace uh, deleted my account. Just, just hit a button, and, and everything just four forty five hundred people. And you know what? I look at. I never went to anybody. I never went to anybody and said, "Hey, I want to add you." I never went and solicited friends. People who just came to me. So it's like forty five hundred people. But you kind of get protective of these people. Like other comics would come to my site and try to leave a comment. I don't even know you. They're trying to steal my friends. Trying to get people to sign up on their site. Right, yeah. and it's like you, you're like you know, it's almost you using friends as currency. Like a friend of yours needs something. Listen, no, they're, they're like cigarettes in prison. Yeah, like you, you, you actually sent me an email. Listen, I put you on my top eight I to put, help uh, out. I did. Yeah, it's, it's like giving me help out. I got about ten thousand. Yeah. Five hundred friends. He's yeah, got Billy, a big, Billy he's got did a big the same show. You know, sword show coming up at oh, Rascals. Oh yeah, in New I like to plug that. He's a gonna what? <laughs> a what? Take my rapier demonstration. <laughs> yeah. What? I'm wondering what Don't is he gonna Bob. do with all these friends? He doesn't have an act, or I mean, what are you gonna do? You gonna? How about I like plug a... the fact that I'm on a friggin' radio show? That's right. How Bill. about I plug uh, if we're yeah, gonna be you're this is our act right here, or going you're somewhere? You're living like radio, our but act. Don't you just do it on the radio? <laughs> what? But but they're already there. <laughs> They've already purchased. This is for new people that come across and. All those say, people, oh. all those 10,000 people just went, hey, look at this man with this M16. I want to be friends with him. Those aren't all <laughs> Opie and Anthony listeners. Are you uh, delusional, man? Yeah, dude. So, some yeah, of them man. are, but some of them are friends of the friends of the Yeah, you probably band. have some of my friends, my right. original people that I want back now. Don't worry, I'll give them back. <laughs> so how many friends do you have on your new account? Uh, 38. Oh. <laughs> Well, dude, you know what it says on the, th the... I showed Anthony the email. It says... Not much better, by the way. It's 371 friends. Oh, right. Is there a picture of Waterloo in the background? <laughs> <laughs> well, this is the thing. Oh, wait, wait. Shh. Oh. Oh. Is it over? Is the uh, morning show over yet? Well, now we're waiting for Dave Rossi. We want to see what kind of chops he has. Does he do, like, three songs? I have no idea. He hasn't talked yet. And then come on. It's been at least three songs. Back sell, front sell, one more song. We'll have to wait and see. Come Mike on. in New York. Mike, what's up? Hey, b -b -b boys What's up, Mike? Um, yeah, we used to play a game called Watery Guy. We'd uh, casually walk up to our friend and point him in the eye and say, Watery Guy. <laughs> <laughs> you poke him in the eye and say, yeah. Watery Guy. <laughs> Yeah, we we stopped doing that when we were about 21. I went up to my friend Chuck and I was like, I said, blink watery eye, got him really good. And he's like, uh, no more. We got to stop doing it. We are right stopping now. watery eye right now. I can't yeah. see. God ever, damn it. You ever play blindside tackle? Oh, that's the best yeah. game, man. Where you set up one of your friends, like you, you know, you have someone kneel behind him. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. You, you set and then up someone comes out of nowhere him, and yeah. blocks him. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and then great. you push him over backwards. That game. Or the, uh, someone has their head down getting stuff out of the locker and you just cross check him. <laughs> those old metal lockers from the 50s. Or slam the door on their head. That's always good, too. Like, Did you ever uh, play the one where you punch your friend right in the asshole muscle? <laughs> We've heard about you guys playing that game, and no, again, never played the punch the <laughs> no, guy in the asshole. Missed out on that one, unfortunately, nobody, Bob. Nobody plays my games. We, 
<laughs> because they all involve the asshole. Yeah, <laughs> horrid games. Really passing are. out. So kidding. far, it's passing out and being fisted. <laughs> That's pretty much the Bob Kelly game. Let's go to Sean and Mineola. Sean. Yo, yo, what's up, boys? Hey, uh, Sean. I want to say that uh, back in the day, we used to play this game. We'd do like 10 squats real fast, and then you have your friends push on your chest as hard as you can. That's like the game where you pass out, and then uh, people start hitting their head and stuff, and that's when the teachers got involved, and you, you couldn't play no more. 10 squats. Good time. It's anything to screw with your blood pressure, and then you, you squeeze the chest or Ooh. the neck, and yeah, yeah. you're out. Weird information at the end. All that's right. when the yeah, teacher got involved. Yeah. That's All when right. the teacher got involved, and we couldn't play anymore. Uh, what? <laughs> God damn. Wow. Yeah. Let's I try it now. Let's choke MySpace somebody too. out. Dude, I don't understand the MySpace. They said that I had copyright infringement mm -hmm. on my page uh, and some other legal job. If you go to... I have actually a copy of... My old MySpace from my web guy who created it for me. Yeah. If you go to robertkellylive.com backwards slash MySpace, it has a photo of what it looked like. And you tell me if you see anything, anything yeah. that has copyright infringement or anything. <laughs> well, if, if that was the fact, like half of the sites would be gone because you post music on them. Yeah. Dude, look at it, That's... dude. You tell me if you see anything. There's I've nothing. I've looked at it. It must no. have been one of your friends had something that was bad. No, look at it right now. Go check I'm it out. I'm not popping We're not it up going right now. to look at your... St do, do you think we can really care? Uh, I hope so. <laughs> Absolutely Please. not. I mean, just a little bit. I care. You, you, it makes for a good story for yeah. two minutes, and then we're going to move on to other shit. That's your hell I like of a the life. goatee, dude. It's my sick goatee. It's uh, coming off today. When he had the wool cap on, he had a uh, Jacques Cousteau's crew look. That looks kind of cool. Really it, makes a little, it gives a little edge. <laughs> a little edge to Ope. Edge. It's evil Opie if it yeah. was a sitcom. <laughs> yeah, a but he needs, he needs like a beret and the goatee <laughs> and, a, and, and a, a little eyeliner on the bottom like in a Star Trek. And, and a, a, a bikey leather jacket that doesn't fit. It's like a little too tight. <laughs> Ugh. With that, gloves that the knuckles are cut out. And then we'll punch each other in the assholes. <laughs> and choke each other out. <laughs> Let's go to Paul in Virginia. Paul. Hey, guys. Hey, we used to play a game called Snot Willy. It's like Wet Willy, but you dig one real good in your nose and put it in someone's ear. Oh, God <laughs> damn. <laughs> uh, oh, Snot Willy? I like yeah. Snot Willy. It's disgusting. How did you get away with that? <laughs> Very good. It's awful. Let's go to uh, Jason in Arizona. Jason. Hey, what's up, guys? Wait, hold on a second. Oh, yeah. Nothing yet? Modest Yahoo, though. Nothing from Saucy Dave Rossi? Not yet. Uh, yes. Jason, Arizona, go. Yeah, um, back in the day, we used to play a game called, we'd roll up to people and say, hey, you want to you want to hurt to donut? And then they're like, what's that? And we'd fucking nail them right in the fucking stern, and they'd be like, hurts, don't it? <laughs> <laughs> All right, check it out, boys. All right, let's go to Samantha in Texas. <laughs> Samantha! Yes. Hey, Samantha. Uh, we used to play Hello. kick it in the twat. <laughs> Samantha. Yes. Go ahead. Turn that radio down you because you're being very distracted. Bitch. Okay, sorry. Yes, you're being very distracted. <laughs> Holy crap. See, our, the signal, we're talking into a mic, but then it's got to go beamed up into outer space. Then it's got to come back. And does that take a little time? And it takes a little bit of time, so there's a delay. Look, oh. for the future callers, we're on a delay. Turn down your radio so we can talk to you. Oh, I turned it down. All right, good. Don't turn it up because you'll hear me call you a stupid bitch. Um, <laughs> go ahead, Samantha. Oh, well, my space rules because, like, there's a lot of friends. But Tom sucks because he deleted my account, and I didn't have no copyright infringement. What was the deletion reason? He said because <clears throat> the, what I had on my page was inappropriate. Samantha, were there naked pictures of you? No. Oh, okay, then we don't Samantha, want to talk to Samantha, with a naked picture yeah. of a chick that you uh, pretended was you? <laughs> no. Samantha? Yes? You don't have anything to add to this program, do you? Okay. Do, do you, Samantha? Samantha. <laughs> <laughs> probably, but probably not. <laughs> Samantha? Yes? Do you, on your MySpace, did uh, your photo, was it just your eyeball? Yeah. Okay. All I've right. seen I know. that chick. I know. I know who you are. I've seen that chick. It's just her eyeball. Yeah. Yeah. There are some girls that like 
Uh. The, it's just a picture <laughs> like their hairline Those. or just an eyeball, yeah. a big blue eye with some mascara you know, on it. Yeah. And then you go to other pictures. Oh, they're just a mess. Oh, wow. It's yeah. a mess. It's just, you know, you know she's a fat chick when it's just an eyeball or a lip. <laughs> Oh, yeah. like just a little bit of cleavage. <laughs> yeah, but you know what's unreal is anybody can get one hot one photo, good picture. one good photo of themselves. That's why you always have to go click on other ones. Yeah. You click on other pictures and then you go, oh, what happened? I like yeah. the hot photo from a distance and you got you're squinting, <laughs> so then you gotta you click on it, and it's still like way off in like the fucking woods yeah. or something. Yeah. And then then they get to the real one, they're like fucking. Yeah. How about the oh, one where hideous. she's a hot chick and then you click on it and there's just pictures of her ugly with her kid. <laughs> it's like, uh, ugh. Hey, can I interrupt for a second? Of course. I, I will bet a lot of money that Dave Rossi, if he's on right now, yeah, will be talking Dave. after this uh, song. Saucy Dave Rossi after this song? Yeah, because you got to backsell the new music, and this is a newer song. Oh, you never play the newer song and then go right into another no, song. No, you, you got to tell your listeners it. what they just heard. I believe he's going by Diamond Dave. Diamond Dave. It's, this oh, is, is it? Modest Saucy. Yahoo, and he's going to have to he's going to have to tell the people that this is Modest Yahoo. Saucy was uh, his Alabama name. Is this is this him? All right. Should be any second. Yeah. Let's hear. Can't wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They did a great job with this song on David Letterman, by the way. A couple nights ago. I'm so psyched to hear him now. Like he's like he a celebrity to, to me now. He has to talk after the song. You don't let a new song go by on the radio without backselling it. You know he's an EMT, right? He's a he's a he's a uh, David Lee Roth. You mean David Lee Roth? Acidic, yeah, he's a uh, acidic EMT. Who? Oh, David Lee Roth. Oh. Acidic EMT. Only for Jewish people. If you die and you're Catholic in front of him, you're screwed. Done for. You're done for. How much longer is this uh, tune? It should be near the end, I yeah. thought. Who is this? Modest Yahoo. Oh. <laughs> that, that's that Hasidic uh, yeah. guy, right? Rapper, reggae. It's pretty good. A little of everything. You can be boss. It's a gimmick. Nah, the, I like the whole city. Here we go. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, Dave Rossi. Wow, oh, I am so wrong. Holy crap, they don't talk on this station. And he's going to make fun of us? He doesn't even do a show. It's already, what, 16 minutes into his shift? And uh, nothing out of That's him. That's what makes us different, man. Man. <laughs> All right, let's go to Tony in Brooklyn. Tony! Hey, what's up, guys? Hey. Buddy, we, used to play this, we used to play this game called Open Neck where, like, you see a friend reading in school or they're not paying attention. And you run up behind him and slap the shit out of the back of that neck, you know? <laughs> Walk around with your elbows up to your ears, you know, your shoulders up to your ears because you don't want to get slapped in the neck. <laughs> <laughs> open neck. Open. When you'd hey, see uh, someone's uh, open neck. Yeah. Bob, Bob, you know, the, uh, the, the copyright infringement might have been R. Kelly's name. Yeah, but I didn't put R. Kelly. R. Kelly? No, well, I, had, I had Robert R. Kelly. Kelly. You, you can't infringe. Robert Kelly, so. Yeah, but so what? I know, I'm a I'm fat sure comedian that. from New York. I'm He's a millionaire that, that they were doing. That's probably pisses on teenage yeah. girls. <laughs> <laughs> he that? doesn't go by uh, he uh, he goes by R Kelly, but yeah, he does R. go by Kelly. Robert Kelly too. Oh, he does. Yeah, I went on the internet and he oh, does. Oh, but that's boy. what the guy's telling me. That I might have. But it's still, I didn't have any of his music up there. I had a you couple. Give a shit about him. Yeah, who cares? I had forty five hundred friends. All right, let's go to Mike in Cleveland. Mike, <laughs> I what never peed on a minor. <laughs> What's up, Mike? Hey, how you guys doing? Uh, pretty good. Hey, we used to play a game called Thailand. Uh-oh. Yeah, you'd walk up to them and ask them what the capital of Thailand was, and they looked at y'all crazy, you'd say Bangkok and punch them in the dick. <laughs> <laughs> They're awful uh, games. <laughs> I like that one. Bangkok and then... Uh, right I think somebody did that, though. It sounds familiar. <laughs> <laughs> right. Or I saw it happen. Is that <laughs> bringing back memories? Memory? Yeah. 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 Childhood molestation yeah. memories. <laughs> like, wait a minute. Did that happen? <laughs> Oh, that is really good. <laughs> no, that one went. You ever seen the inside of a van? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's say hi to Donahue in Philly. Donahue. Yo, what's up, guys? What's up? Uh, Bob Bob knows me. I'm the one that told him about the Vicodin trick under his tongue. 
Oh, that's oh. you, you psycho. You got me. I almost had to go to rehab because of this asshole. <laughs> what happened? The Vicodin Remember when check. I hurt my leg? Yeah. The guy, uh, I was taking the Vicodin, but it wasn't kicking in right. He goes, listen, he, he, he I used to message me, I think, email me, he says, uh, smash up the Vicodin, a half a Vicodin, and put it under your tongue, and then eat the the whole one. So not, I was I was eating the whole one, and then putting the other one under my tongue like cocaine. Those things are huge, though. They're huge. They are. Even but half of one would make like a... You were supposed to cut half up and crush it and eat the other half, not a whole other pill. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, you know what, dude? You might want to type that in before you wind me up in rehab. The Betty Ford <laughs> Clinic. Dude, I was out of my mind for a week. I was waking up shaking. My hands were quivering. That shit ass. make you itch. Dude, oh, it's just, it makes you do a lot of things. Let me tell you. It makes you itch. Let's take them on for that toothache I had. Yeah. yeah. That toothache yeah. I had last year, and I just ran out <laughs> yesterday. <Yeah. laughs> oh, shit. We just lost the uh, we lost the feed. How do we lose yeah. the feed? I fucked up. Oh no! I fucked up. If the guy's we talk don't now. get how long listen. is it gonna take? Uh, Out of the up. way, uh, Donna. You anything else? Yeah, yo. I talk. I was actually talking to little Jimmy about this two nights ago. Um, what they might have done, Bob, is they might have bombed your MySpace account. What you gotta do is you gotta set all your like little notes on your website so you personally approve them so they can go on because what somebody could have done is they could have put up like an R. Kelly song like one of his people put an R. Kelly song in it, it's one of your comments and then reported you so what you gotta do is you gotta click on account settings and set your privacy settings oh okay man you know dude Don't email me that it. would you will you email me that information or hit me up All on right. All right, cool. I'll, next time I see you on email, I'll hire you. I appreciate that. Uh, right, yeah. Yeah. Uh, what a all, shift. If anybody wants to add me, it's J Donahue on MySpace. D O N O G H U E. It's not MySpace, it's MySpace. All right, Donahue, Bye. thank you. All right, guys. Bye. Out. Uh, they're playing another song. <laughs> Holy crap. Let's say hi to Chuck in Connecticut. Chuck. Maybe they have a Wi Fi and they're listening. I, uh, we probably got the guy real nervous today. Chuck, what's up? Not much. How are you? Hey. Point. Chuck? Chuck? Yes. Yes. Hi. You're nervous, aren't you? Absolutely. Aren't you, Chuck? Chuck. Yes. <laughs> what? Uh, I fucking it's love that. It's a new bit that we <laughs> are working on. It's pretty funny. I like it. It's going to give... It, uh, we need a little more time with it, but... Chuck? Yes. <laughs> You're still Hello. sitting there. Aren't you, Chuck? Chuck? Yes. Chuck. Chuck? Yes. Okay. What do you got for the show? Uh, I've got a game to play with my friends called Fish Hook. Right in the when somebody's yawning, jam your finger in their mouth and I hook them right in the cheek. Jesus Christ. You put your finger in somebody's mouth? Yeah. That's not good. Nah, you don't want to. I don't no, want that. No, I'm not I'd rather get that game. Bangkok would be better than that. Yeah, um, Bangkok was the best one. Thank you, Chuck. No problem. All right. Um, I, I wouldn't fish hook. <coughs> fish hook and punch in the ass game. I'm not playing. The other ones, or Bangkok. I don't want to play Bangkok. <laughs> so I can to... choke you out? <laughs> choke me out. You don't, you don't have to Bangkok. choke me out before Bangkok or punch in the ass game. I wonder if anybody ever tried that game with, like, Master Poe when he was in, like, the eighth grade. <laughs> Somebody just slapped the back of his neck. <laughs> As he whirls around and pulls you out of the room by your nostrils. <laughs> have you seen his my MySpace photo? His photo... <laughs> He has a student in like some sort of reverse headlock and his fingers in the guy's nostrils pulling his head back. <laughs> pulling the head back? Yeah. yeah. Then you click on all his other photos and it's all just shit just like that. Him. And they delete my MySpace, but this psychopath still has his friends. Tearing people apart. Because right. he's not Master P. So what's the That's new the MySpace pole. account? <laughs> right. Did we give the... Uh, it's actually the same one, Rob, uh, MySpace uh, slash Robert Kelly Live. I put the same one back up. But now I gotta figure out what the hell to do before they delete it again. I, I almost wanted to turn in everybody I knew, <laughs> so everybody, nobody oh, yeah. had friends. Being in the oh, same yeah, boat. Watch yeah, I wanted to rat. Billy, you. I wanted to get Dane. Imagine Dane's account getting deleted. What has he got? Like a million? Set, yeah, it was as a million people. <laughs> you gotta give it up to him for being that fucking honest. You know, uh, he's like, I was so mad because you know what? I had it before everybody. You know <gasps> what I mean? Did. Not, not you, Bill. Well, who, who, are you saying I, you invented MySpace? Well, not who, you. Who, who <laughs> not, not anybody yeah. in this room. <laughs> so what you're saying is you started before all of us and we all passed you? Well, yeah, you guys actually, yeah, that's usually, that's the one thing about MySpace that sucks. You can see where you are on this business. Yeah. Oh, I saw you, 
You and Norton just flew past me. I was checking in to see where you were at. Oh, you flew past morning. me, too. Five in the morning, I got Bobby. I know he's this checking my shit. the easiest shit. job uh, ever. You, you, you bought, all of you flew past me. Yeah. What, that bad? sucks. I think I'm paranoid. This is funny. I think he's listening, because I think I'm paranoid by garbage. This is six in a row so far? <laughs> he's got to play something. He's I mean, gotta he's got to come back It's and, been a half hour uh, of talk. music. Well, good. If that means he keeps playing music, he'll get fucked for not playing the stupid Oreo commercial, right? <laughs> <laughs> Keep playing the songs, Rebel. Come wow. on, <laughs> Saucy Dave Rossi. You're getting us there, Diamond Dave. Pretty good strategy if uh, people are uh, on to us playing it, because then it's like, wow, they're just playing music. <laughs> which means he's listening to Satellite Radio. Right, which means he's listening to Satellite Radio, or Aren't you, somebody Dave? is, unlike your <laughs> quote here. <laughs> Unlike uh, his quote, which was, uh, hey, did you hear what Opie and Anthony did on the radio today? Nobody did. Satellite radio, it's awesome. I think Dave heard. I think Dave did hear. I think Dave listens a lot. Someone's listening Don't to you, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hey, uh, John in Utah, what's up? Yeah, you need to do a, a little game we used to call Midnight Office Renovation. We're the boxes, pack up everybody's shit. Just assemble the cubicles and stack them up in the middle of the room. Sounds like a lot of work. That sounds like that's, a day yeah. job. That's work. That's like a second job. That's work, but it gets rid of the, the uh, Mexican. The little <laughs> you want to you harass. That's not half as funny as punch in the asshole. All right, we're gonna have to give up on Dave Rossi, I think. No, we can't. Keep him in the background. I I gotta hear him now. Well, Steve is coming in here with our new game, Coming or Going. Coming or Going. You want to play that before, before we get out of here? Yeah. Where's Steve? Let's Steve? Get Steve. Steve. Steve, we need We want you. to play Coming or Going, the first ever bit we ever did on XM Satellite Radio. Radio. Satellite After our Radio. two-year absence. Thanks, Hi, Steve. Hi. You have, uh, oh, there's the disc. <laughs> no, you don't give us the answers. Uh, I don't give you the answers. They don't play his they don't intro play no music more? anymore. I that, love that. That was actually pretty good, bro. Yeah, I got one here. I still All right, all right. Here. Oh, look, he's driving by. Oh, oh, here, here he goes. He's going to land. And. Oh, look, he took <laughs> off again. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. Ninety six. Steve. Yep. Good what to see you. Thank you. How are you? Oh, you're leaving it running just in case you gotta leave. Yeah, just in case. Going. <laughs> we going, Sorry. Dave. Sorry. <laughs> Did you ask? It? <laughs> oh, is that it? Is this over? Ah. <laughs> Damn it. Let's see if performance things on the burner right here. Oh. Bojangles defined. <clears throat> gotta is when you got to have some Bojangles. A craving for that one-of-a-kind taste of our famous chicken and biscuits. What's it? Wanna is when you don't really got to, but you just really sort of want to have some Bojangles. Nita is a much stronger feeling than gotta or wanna, and is that really passionate craving you get for Bojangles, chicken and or biscuits. Get up. What it's year is it in the South? How much you need wow. or wanna Bojangles, and actually get up off of your butter and get some. And finally, Papa <laughs> is the end result of get up, and you actually get her to have some. Or in other words, you get to eat. Of course, usually in the case of Bojangles, all of these things happen together very quickly and in this order. <laughs> Two pieces of chicken, one fixin', and a bottom of biscuit. Whites only, please. Throw up. Black people will be fire hosed and bitten by German shepherds. Oh, jangles? That's Bojangles. jangles. It is Bojangles. Thank you for listening. This station is in a commercial break and will be returning to its regular programming shortly. Oh, what a pussy. He he played a half hour of music and went right into commercials. He knows you listen. He knows you. Is that an internet what feed? What a pussy! Oh, and the internet feed doesn't—they block the commercials out. But that was him. 
Was uh, that Dave Rossi doing the Bojangles chicken read or something? No, no. Everyone's saying no, no, no. Bojangles. Was he doing ben the, shaking the, his head means nothing to me. All right, someone. I have. I need confirmation. Ben is like shaking his head, but it's just Ben. Someone's got to monitor the station because uh, we can't spend another half hour listening to crappy music. It's free music. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rob, bit, Rob, Rob, bit, bit, Rob, bit, 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 b